What up, everybody? Game day here again. Game day, J. Hope the name sticks <laughs> or rings a bell. I mean, I've been playing so many fucking games. I mean, damn, I'm all over the place. We are doing Four Horns. This is Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate Online Wii U. Let's get it. Playing with another homie in here, Rory Lee. Other everybody else is a fucking um, random. I do not know them. We're doing the Four Horns battle. Um, basically, fight, kill, cap, or kill two. Uh, Diablos. Now these guys are pretty wild. Um, if you don't know how to fight them, they can be a pain. Um, you want to take out the horns. They have two horns each. Um, take out the horn, cut off the fucking tail, and destroy that hump on his back. So if you can do all that, it's all good. At least cut off the tail and at least break the horns. Concentrate your um, hip. Concentrate your um, attacks on the horn and the tail mostly. Um, I don't really think anything's done with the wings. I don't remember them. I don't ever remember them being something primary to check up on or go after. Uh, we're on sandy plains right now, um, nighttime right now. So you need to bring a hot drink. If you don't bring a hot drink on this level to keep yourself cooled down or um, keep yourself warm, I should say, that would be the opposite if it was a, if it was a hot day then your stamina or health is going to go down. So, up to you guys if you don't come prepared. Um, another thing you want to do is bring sonic bombs. Uh, when this fool starts digging to go inside the ground, you toss it. There's the other one down there. I guess he had to be nosy. Nosy neighbors. <laughs> Somebody's dizzy. Who is it? Bak Bayako? Bayako? I think that's how you say the name. So the one we were originally fighting ran away. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and tag this guy. Always bring a paintball. Otherwise, if you don't know the levels for the game, guess what? You're going to be running around forever looking for these guys. And I'm pretty sure you guys had to do this. Everybody's gone through that. Where they're like, where is the fucking creature? I can't find it. Especially when you don't know the areas they usually dwell in. Um, I guess we, were, we just decided to fight this one since he's already over here. Not like we, did, we put too much damage in on the other one. Um, Diablo's, um, Diablo's, his weakness is ice, so if you have an ice weapon, bring it. And just like I said right there, he barreled into the ground, um, one of the homies threw a sonic bomb, you just throw it, when they're going, right when they go on the ground, you toss it. Always bring fucking flash grenades or flash bombs, every time they come out the ground, they will fly up. You flash them, there's free hits, everybody will go for the tail, go for the horns, simple as pie. Um, I don't have any ice weapons. I'm using a fire hammer right now. This one does fire damage. Uh, I think he's, like, kind of lay the fuck down, for one. Um, he's, I think fire is pretty good for him. The homie ends up paralyzing him. Um, that's the thing with the hammer, though. You will get knocked around. If you have a hammer user, you get in the way. Um, let the person with the hammer mostly do the work on the head. You go for the tail. If you're a bladesman, and you got the fucking, um, good shit. If you got the fucking, um, blade, that's the only way you can take off the tail. Unless you have a, um, a bow gun that shoots, um, some, I don't know. I don't think I've seen slicing bullets in here, so that's kind of weird to me. I'm pretty sure they have them, though. I just haven't really looked too much, because I haven't been bow gunning. But, um, I am going to start bow gunning more in this game. Actually made a few armors for it. Just, just haven't been using them because they haven't been powered up enough. Gonna start bow gunning more, but anyways, this fool gets hyper, and um, when he burrows into the ground and he's in rage mode, you cannot get him. You cannot catch him with the sonic bomb. So don't be, don't waste them. Um, dangerously low on health right now. One more hit probably would have killed me. Diablos is no joke, man. He will fucking kill you. You can see which way he goes when he falls on the ground. When he goes on the ground, you can see the little, um, what, what should I call it? Dirt or dust kind of pops off the ground. 
So yeah, we're going to town on this guy right now. We are going to town. But yeah, you want to bring um, ice weapons if you have them. Did he just go to the same area with the other dudes? I think that's the old one. We're going for the one that's almost dead. And you can tell which one you you mess you you hurt the most by um, obviously its appearance. This one has no horns, so this is the one we were fucking working on. We're gonna go after him, and he's dead. So basically, like I said before, you do what you're supposed to do on these monsters. You will tell that they're almost ready for capture or to kill. Um, you break the horns, you cut the tail. They're probably almost dead. Just put a little bit more work onto them, you'll know. I'm surprised he didn't go down to um, Area 11, because usually when they're about ready to die, they go down to that little den down there. Always make sure you carve the monster. I'm just talking for talking to people who don't know anything about the game and people that are new to the game. Um, always make sure your blade is sharpened. Always make sure your stamina is up. Stamina can be refilled with rations, um, well done meat, um, energy drinks too. You guys see how my blade up there by my, well not right now, right now, how my blade up there is blinking blue. It's right below the, um, good job, they sonic bombed him. I would be on top of that too, but um, I don't have any sonic bombs. I'm the flash bomb guy. So, I always flash bang boogie these guys, just like now. Get the fuck out the air. Um, make sure your weapon's all the way fucking, um... All the way, what do you call it? Use the whetstone to make sure your your blade's all the way sharpened. If it's not all the way sharpened, you're not getting the maximum damage. Got the tail off again. I'm gonna try to go for the hammer hit. Try to knock him out, but it didn't work. Another time for the hammer. That should have been a KO right there. That should have been a KO. My stamina is running low, so I can't charge the hammer. I gotta let it refill. As you can see, the yellow gauge is going up. Anytime you use anything with um, with the hammer, like you do a charge attack, it takes away from the. Um, how did I get hit with the fucking stump of the tail? It takes away from the. Um, what you call it? Oh, this guy was about to get hit. Look, he's one hit kill. I flash bang fucking Diablos. I saved his life. Um, anytime you die in a game, you cost everybody money. Just want to let you know that three kill, three deaths equals game over. Doesn't matter who dies, three deaths in a row or whatever. That's it. Um, once again, I have an armor on that has the ability for wide range. Every armor has its own ability when you equip everything, and there's other shit you can play around with. Um, you just gotta look at the abilities. You can buy decorations. I know nobody really explains this kind of stuff. I could have died right here. I'm trying to get the fuck out of here. When I'm stuck. Um, decorations, you put them into your um, armor. Every Not every armor, but most armors have like a couple slots where you can... It says slot where you can put um, actual gems into your armor to help make it more stronger. Or make another... What do you call it? Make another uh, ability stronger. So right now I have like wide range sharpener. Sharpener makes means that I can sharpen my weapon faster. Cause usually it takes like three strokes on the sword to make it go up. So right now if I use use it, it'll only do one stroke. You get me? You get what I mean? Wide range is an ability. They tell the abilities tell you like when you go check out your armor sets, it tells you what the ability does. Um, wide range heals everybody or uses um like if I use a heal, it'll heal them. It'll heal them, but it has to be like a herb or a regular pot. I'm waiting for the flashbang. Always do this. I want to get all the extra hits we can. Oh my god, that was a waste right there, but we destroyed him. We broke one horn, that's not bad. We cut off the tail, that's great. Always good to give people props, man. It makes people feel good. Um, such an epic feeling when you defeat some of these big fucks, especially when you get taken out and you find a good group to play with. Give them a friend, give them a friend request, or give them your guild card. I should say. People don't be shy in these games, man. We're on here to hunt. We're online. If people are online, then they probably want to talk more or less. 
So yeah, uh, we probably should have captured him. Uh, I want to make this clear. Like usually, if there's two monsters like are the same, you probably want to capture one and kill one if you can. You get better rewards. Um, I just want to make that known. A lot of people just want to kill it all the time, or people just want to capture it all the time. I think you should capture it only if it has special items like rubies. Like certain monsters give you rubies when you capture them. You know what I mean? Like you can't find certain things by carving them or killing them. You have to capture them to get certain items. A lot of people don't know that. So that's okay. And just like that, um, the match is over. I'm collecting my rewards, sending them to my box, not putting them in my pouch because your pouch will be full in a heartbeat. And got a new time done. And I'm going to go ahead and call that a video. Thanks for coming through. Please stay tuned. I have more videos on the way. It's game day, baby. Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate Wii U. Yeah.